Hi everyone, so today we're going to be having a little look at some of the goodies I got from Bond Cauldron. So here we have our post from Bond Cauldron and she's put a very nice just little blessed bee on our box as well. Let's spin the camera around and take a look shall we? Now I have two little disclaimers for this. The first one is that some of these items I did win in a raffle. Um, I just want to put that out there. I'll make a statement on what I did win, but I did win some in a raffle. The second statement I want to make is that I did get these about a month or so ago. So it isn't going to be an unboxing, more like um, showing off the haul, I guess. <laughs> so we'll have a little look first at what I actually won in the competition. Um, and then we'll move on to the bits and bobs that I bought myself. So the first thing that I had won is this gorgeous little cauldron. It is for incense cones. As you can see, I've already got a cone in there. Probably using it wrong, but that's a little incense cone burner. Next, we have the black magic mug. So this is just a mug with a little pentagram on. I have to admit, haven't used it yet, um, which is a bit bad of me, but hey ho. So that's. I'm trying to think where I can put things so that they look nice. Next, I won some incense sticks. So I won Pagan Magic. I'm not sure what the scent of this one is. Nope, not sure. So that one's Pagan Magic. I also won Black Magic. Again, I'm not 100% sure what the scent is. And Goblin's Layer. And then the Protection Incense Sticks. Um, and these ones are by Lisa Parker. So that one comes with a little um, protection spell that you can do as well. So I put them to the side here. So much stuff. Um, the next things that I won were some incense cones to go inside our little cone burner. So I got the Stanford Wizard spell. These ones are scented with patchouli. And then also Witch's Curse. Um, I'm not 100% sure what the scent of that one is. Yeah, I'm not sure what the scent of that one is, but they smell nice, I can say that. Um, finally for the incense cones, I got the Satya Super Hit ones. Um, I think these are Nag Shampa scented. So yeah, that's those. I think I'm going to move some of these out the way a bit just so that we've got some room because there's there's a lot of stuff let me tell you I'll move that to the back up there okay so again these are things that I won in the um the giveaway so this one is a candle from the luminescent candle company this one was named blessed bee it's got one of my favourite burners actually, which is these wood ones. I just love the crackling effect they give. As you can see, it's quite well used. Um, I don't even know how to describe the scent. It's quite a fresh and relaxing one. I just normally have this burning on an evening. So that is our Blessed Bee candle. And then I got a talking board like a Ouija planchette um, spell candle holder and finally I got some witch's salt provided by Bond Cauldron so that's our witch's salt I have to admit I'm still not 100% sure what it's for or what it does I presume it's for use in spells um, but if anybody knows please feel free to educate me 
Your girl's still a witchling at the end of the day, so... Yeah. And then finally, we're going to move on to the items that I did actually purchase myself, because obviously... I wasn't happy with just having that. I wanted to get some other goodies from Bonnie. And I'm quite happy that I did. So, she had a special offer on over, like, the start of Christmas. I don't know if it's still going. Um, but you would get, basically, um, some spell candles with the planchette holder. Obviously, um, this candle did not come with it, but I have been using it. So that is our talking board thing that came with it. You would then get a set of spell candles. And with that, you also got a little crystal. So I think this one's maybe citrine. I don't know. If you know, pop it in the comments below for me because I'm terrible when it comes to crystals. So we have our yellow candles there with our yellow crystal. Um, I got some pink spell candles here. And that is to go with my piece of rose quartz that I got. I'm pretty sure this one's rose quartz. Again, if I'm wrong, let me know. Um, I got some green spell candles. I think these ones were possibly a freebie, but I can't remember exactly. Um, the sets that had the spell candles, crystal, and the little holder were three pounds. I forgot to say that. So then I've got my next set of spell candles. I just love the beeswax effect, so I got some in orange and a pale blue. So those are our other spell candles. The beeswax spell candles cost one pound fifty, I want to say. Yeah, one pound fifty each like per duo um which i don't think is bad for that um i did decide to treat myself and i'm probably not going to be able to get this open now with my fake nails so bonnie did have some um like crystals in so i went for these these are the little ones that you can hang on a necklace. So I believe this one is gold sandstone or gold stone. And this one is Dalmatian Jasper. She gave me a little card telling me what it means. I unfortunately lost the card for that one. Um, but that is our little necklaces there. Ooh. Now, one thing that I did want for a while is I wanted to get some hagstones. Um, ward off curses, sickness and nightmares, and they are known as doorways slash windows to other realms to see spirits and the fae. And I had wanted a hagstone for a while, and I tried to find some myself and struggled. I couldn't do it. <laughs> um, so I did get some from Bonnie. These were £1.50 each, so I decided to go for two. So this is our first hagstone. So as you can see, that's our see-through point on this one. Nice and simple. Um, and then this is our second hagstone, which obviously has a much more obvious hole to it. So that's our other hagstone. Move the stones over here, just so they're out the way. Um, next, I went for some selenite. Um, it's known for cleansing and charging other crystals. Connects to the angelic realm. Builds the psychic gift of clairvoyance. Cleanses the aura, crown, and third eye chakras. So I'll pop that there. And what I did was I opted for a selenite wand. I just thought it was really pretty, it caught my eye on the pictures. You can see there how it's catching the light. So the selenite wand cost me £2. I don't know if she's got any small ones left, I know she was looking at some bigger ones. Um, but that is our selenite wand. Next I have the Vampire Tears little candle. 
this one obviously has been burned um, and this is also from the Luminescent Candle Company and again I don't know how to describe the scent I am terrible at describing scents um, I'd say this is maybe like it's not floral it's kind of like a deep maybe musky scent does it say on it what the scent is not really <laughs> but anyway that is Vampire Tears I wanted it mainly because it's a star and the colours were pretty so that is our candle there and coming up to the final pieces the luminescent candle company does um wax melts and look at these so these have got pentagrams on i couldn't resist <laughs> i'm saying this a lot but i couldn't resist um so i did get four these are one pound fifty each like per different scent or if you want six of the same scents it's four pounds so one pound fifty for one Six, uh, four pounds if you want six of this scent for example um so you can choose the scent and you can choose the color for yourself so i went for a pale blue breathe easy i think where i can put you pop you there i went for kind of like a dark colored oriental musk i went for green woodland walks and that just reminds me of the woods and everything i love it so that's the green woodland walks and finally i got opted for a red dragon's blood one um it's one of my favorite scents i have to admit i've got so much dragon's blood incense it's crazy that i wanted to get myself a wax melt um so you can see on the back it's all labeled up it contains dragon's blood and patchouli essential oils for that one so that is our dragon's blood i wonder if these say on the back then what the scents are as well okay so woodland walk contains pure spruce pine and cedar wood essential oils oriental musk contains uh, i'm not sure what that one contains there you go <laughs> i'm not gonna try and pronounce it because it would end badly and then breathe easy contains pure rosemary eucalyptus peppermint cajaput and camphor probably said those wrong essential oils um and that was the final item i also got this really cute shush spell casting in progress magnet included in my goodies so that is everything that we got from bonnie and it wasn't that expensive it was four pound 90 for the postage um hagstones were one pound 50 the stones by themselves are one pound 50 the selenite wand was two pounds the wax melts were one pound 50 each so i did spend six pounds on those but couldn't resist um the beeswax candles are one pound fifty each our little pendants were one pound fifty each and then the candles the stone and the holder they were three pounds for the set and then obviously in my giveaway i won sorry in my raffle win i got the four incense um four packs of incense sticks three packs of incense cones i got the talking board holder just realized i forgot to show you this one i also won this little incense holder with the moon and stars on it's really cute and i apologize for missing that out initially um so i won that i got the incense cone burner and then our black magic hmm? our black magic mug and the little candle and witch's salt so that's our haul from bond's cauldron i will leave a link in the description below as usual now bonnie i don't think has an official website or anything but she has got a facebook group so i'll link the facebook group below and i believe she just got herself an etsy store so i'll link that in the description as well feel free to head over there and leave her some love and I hope you all have a lovely time. I shall see you next time. Take care, everyone.